Hey everybody, how y'all doing? It is I, Super Paul Games. Welcome back to Navy Football. This is our very last game of the year. Well, regular season. We will get a bowl game. I have no idea which one. Uh, the classic Army-Navy game. Go Navy. Sorry, I was getting a drink of water. <laughs> we are ranked right now number three in the country. Hi everybody, Brad Nessler in the booth, along with Kirk Herbstreet. Aaron Andrews is reporting from it's the It's Christmas Bowl! EA Sports and ESPN are teaming up to bring you today's exciting game between the Army Black Knights and the Midshipmen of Navy. This is the home of the Liberty Bell and the best Philly cheesesteaks you'll ever find. Philadelphia and Lincoln Financial Field is the site of today's game. The snow is going to fall most of the day today. It's kind of nice that we get to finish in a snowball. I love games in the snow. I don't like driving in the snow. That sucks ball. <laughs> See, like, because I live in the north. Too much snow up where I live. Um, but yeah, go Navy! I was saying we're number three in the nation. There are four undefeated teams left. Ohio State, USC, Navy, and this Boise State. This to be a heck of a late season matchup. They're playing today in hopes of impressing the pollsters and the bowl reps. For Army, the key to their defense is their excellent linebacker. He'll be keeping tabs on a really good running what? back. They shouldn't be talking about our team. Army's like four and seven or some shit. We're eleven and zero. We don't get no respect. Reese's peanut butter cups, the perfect combination of chocolate and peanut butter. So Ohio State is number one. USC is number two. If the national championship were happened today. We would not be in. We need one of them to lose, most likely. I don't know who USC is playing, but Ohio State is playing Michigan right now. If Michigan could beat Ohio State, then I think we're going to the National Bowl game. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. I should say National Championship. Otherwise, we'll probably get a decent bowl game, which would suck if we go 12-0 and and we don't end up number one. But... And of course, if we lose this game, there is no chance we have going to the um, BCS championship. It's second down, and they're about two yards away. Come on, defense! It's the last regular season game too for our seniors. People like Tenla Salt. Goes to the fullback and dropped. I'm not so sure he made the best decision that time. That was a pretty tight area. Well, fullbacks are not exactly known for their hands, you know what I mean? Oh, they're coming out three wide. Let's come out in nickel. It's third down. Put a safety in the middle of the field just in case. I'm sorry, not a safety. Middle linebacker king. Come on, get there. Don't let him do the option. As a quarterback, you have Good read by the defense. Frazier was on it. So it's fourth down. The punter comes on the field. Getting this has been an outstandingly off. fun season. It's a shame that we only have one more game after this, which will be a bowl game. Oh, Captain Football! There! Actually, that's okay blocking. He makes it out to make nice return. Not much there on that opening drive. I'm sure the fans are thrilled to see Obviously, I say Captain Football because he was um, blocking. He's actually got as much grief as they've given him this season. He's got a lot of tackles. I think it's mostly because he can't cover people well, but he's good at tackling afterwards. Good, let go of the turd. The D lineman wasn't letting in. And the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole where that play was supposed to go. Come on, Tom. Oh, shit. There we go. Protection held just long enough to get that off to Club Panic for a touchdown. Man, Club Panic has been doing great lately with a run after the catch. 
The wide receiver made this play. Where Ashton Goat was waving him in, but he didn't show up. Uh, all alone. It's okay, Ashton Goat. You're the true MVP. Or MVG. Most valuable goat. Playcock? <laughs> you see the... The camera didn't switch back until Ass and Goat started his dancing. He's like, no. And the play clock went way down. You can't do anything until I get my dance move out. He deserves it. We're up by seven. There you go. We're the most powerful branch. See, the, they've got to give us more funding, right? Isn't this how funding is defended? If that was true, though, if the armed ser services got funding based on how well they did in college football, they would recruit people who are much better at football. Maybe not so good when it comes to being officers, though. Williams picks up around five yards there on the option play. Yeah, let's come out and cover one. Army trying to play spoilers. They know we got bowl dreams. Yeah! I feel bad for their quarterback. Nobody protected him on that side. Death Haven came through totally unblocked. their own 28 yard line let's bring a linebacker blitz on the right side oh come on nobody's getting through oh good job way to knock it down that's Frazier slapping it down playing uh pass protection out there it's fourth down looks like they're gonna punt it away here Lamb is the putter. Those blocks! Tackle at the 32. Well, the 41 decided he wanted to go block a different way, I guess. Thing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little There we go, Club Panic again! Be able to force him into a mistake. Man, he's gonna become the next all-star on this team. This is the timing that we talked about. I don't know what year this is. I don't know if he's a senior or not. I know he's been around for a while. And his receiver is there to make a nice grab. But can you hear me? I'd probably have the worst speech ever. So the big game For all you guys who aren't going to be back next year, have a good life in the Navy. I'm like, you don't know which of us are seniors? Good outside run there. Yeah, nice five-yard gain. Go Wolfie. That brings up second and five. From the 28-yard line, second down. I bet you this kind of year or time of year it's better to be in a mascot up outfit. You can see um has to go over there on the right. It keeps you warm. There you go. Keep pushing, Wolfie. Nice job by the offensive line, too. That's the first. I like how efficient the offense looked on that play. Everybody knew their assignment and all came together. Sadly we don't have anyone in the running for the Heisman. You can see that the Wolfies already get a thousand yards on the season. From the 19 yard line, first down. For the first time today, we'll get to see how this defense responds when they're backed up into the red zone. They'll keep it on the ground again. Oh, that's another first. All day, every day. Great job here converting and keeping this defense on the field. We're getting very tired. Uh, let's go to the fullback. We've seen it a lot this year. The Mr. Rogers. Oh, I want to call that power option. Looking to cap this off with a touchdown. Oh, maybe I should have. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Kick it to the left. Fullback straight ahead. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Four yards gain. That brings up 
Oh man, we hardly ever call plays like that. Let's call the po power option. See if I can remember how to lateral it. They're crowding the line. It's gonna be Thomas to the right, um, with Wolfie as our option. There you go, well, Thomas. Yeah. The nice thing about an option like that is if they're all, you know, stacked in the middle to stop the run, you're going around. It's kind of like doing a bootleg pass in that regard. Ooh, and it's good! And now we take a look at the drive summary. Season has gone by so fast. I'm in old man mo coach mode. I remember in the early 2000s. The 23 yard line. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. He looks to Somebody get through? Nobody got through. Oh, nice job. That's Captain Football 2 slamming him down. Receiver, you've got to be able to take some hits and hang on to the football. It's just part of the game. <laughs> They're challenging him again, though. You can see Captain Football right there. We've had a couple games now where they keep challenging him. Because often people catch passes on him, but he's getting better. No! Oh, yeah. They had a good matchup there. They had a receiver, I think, on our fullback. Or was the tight end? I'll admit Coach Paul wasn't paying that much of an attention. We're doing all out blitz. Oh shit! That's not good. Good run by Army. Taking advantage of our blitz on the inside. Going right around it. Finally, they got the option to work for him. down 10 yards to go Ball on the 18 yard line let's see if their play calling changes now that they're in the red zone for the first time yeah there we go poor guy blindsided by death haven i think it was didn't even see it he didn't from the 24 yard line second down it's like a submarine man Popped up to attack you. Here's the option. And down he goes at the 24. And oh, I think we just broke his rib or something, poor guy. Oh, they destroyed me, coach. Other than that one time when I brought the blitz on the inside, we have crushed their option every time they've run it. As they take a look at that injury on the sideline. Let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. No, 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 no! And that sets them up with a first and goal. On third and long, they get the first down, but was it Damn it. close or not? What a relief. Marshall was in town, but he caught him too late. To work with. Here they go. First and goal. Oh, the quarterback's going to be out for two quarters. I guess he bruised his sternum. Brought down at the three-yard line. Koch gets around three on that toss to the halfback. This linebacker's had a couple years of experience, and he's really solidified himself as a reliable tackler, as you can see from that last stop. <laughs> oh, that poor... 
poor quarterback. I think that was Death Haven again. Just he continues to break through their left side. The ball's on the six-yard line, and we've got third and goal. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. There you go. Get that pressure. Nice job getting his hands up. Get your hands up. You know, they're liable to put the ball in the air on third, so it's a smart play to keep your hands ready. I don't know who the hell Gatewood is. <laughs> That's what I say to him when he comes over to you. Great job! Who the fuck are you? Coach him down the team all year. Great story. As we change ends of the field, I don't think we're going to be seeing much of a change in the outcome. The score here in Denver is Navy 14, Army 3. Hey, that was a pretty good drive by Army. Our defense has done very good this year. We've shut out better teams than Army skill-wise. So they deserve some credit for that. He's tackled at the 28. The offense now will take the field, and they hope to have the same success they had on their last drive. And it was a really nice drive, too, Brad. The quarterback got into a nice rhythm and did a good job of picking apart the defense. We had a lot of good runs, too. Um, he may last have drive. Thomas, back to throw. Come on, get that, get that. Oh, we had a free play. Their defense was offside. That's why we're taking a shot. That's just a discipline thing. There. That sucks. We had one-on-one -on -one there. And our receiver didn't really come back and fight for it like I would have hoped they would. Oh, we still got a free play. And we gained five yards. He rolls left. Come on, Butler, get there. Don't let him... No! Don't let him get you in the inside. Oh... Was a little underthrown too. Hey, what's that jackass doing on my screen? From their own 17 yard line. He's got some it's boxing shorts. Has to go, go fight him. I think that's where Has to go would probably be like, I'm a lover, not a fighter. Well, then I'm gonna go make love to him. This is because we're in the city of brotherly love. That's not what it means. Their own 15-yard line. Oh, we bruised that guy too. I almost feel bad for that. <laughs> like most other teams, I wouldn't care, but I, I'm not so happy when we hurt Army's dudes. Here's the option, and he's gonna be sacked. Ah, the option of going backwards. I like that option. Third down and 15. Ball on the 12. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh shit. 26 almost slapped it right back at that guy. I think it was 26. Yeah, that dude who's hiding. Get back here. Don't you hide from coach. Now the incompletion will force the fourth down and a punt. Lamb is waiting for the snap. Good job by the defense there. And he's taken down at the 45 yard line. And the offense will take the field, and they're certainly hoping to do better than they did on their last drive, which ended with a turnover. This quarterback can make good passes. He just needs to focus on not forcing the ball to his receiver. Force the ball? Okay. He's scrambling. Yeah. And they make the stop at the 27. <laughs> good catch by Sheepy's big old gain downfield. Young man to get the ball out of his hands. He was facing an all-out blitz and didn't panic at all. It's a nice pass and a new set of downs to show for it. Yeah, Thomas hasn't been nervous at all in this game. I don't know if it counts like a home game, even though we're playing in Philly, which is really neutral territory. Ooh, nice run by Indigo Wolfie. That's a first. From the 16-yard line, first down. 
So their last red zone visit resulted in a touchdown. Let's see if the defense can no. this time. <laughs> keep blocking. Tackle made at about the 13. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Second down. They'll line it up at the 12. Ooh, Butler. Thomas calls an audible. He's rolling right. Decides to tuck it in and he's got space. <laughs> oh, he didn't hurt himself. Oh, that was a big jump. Technically, I think that should be a touchdown. Because the goal line... Oh, no, he might have stepped out before then. Because I was going to say, the goal line technically goes beyond the pylon. They've got the defense on their heels now. It's first and goal. Ball on the one-yard line. They're crowding the line. Ooh, yeah. Good job, offensive line. That's a touchdown for Wolfie. I don't know if it's going to make a difference if we run up the score or not. I don't know if the coaches will, um, I don't know if they're going to pay attention to that or not. Like, once upon a time, that used to matter. I don't know if it matters in the game or not. I tell you what, though, if Michigan beats Ohio State... <laughs> And somehow Mich Ohio State's still ahead of us in the rankings. I'll be so mad. Especially because we beat Michigan already. Yeah, you ain't going nowhere, son. That is just a great play getting into the backfield. This guy is so quick that the ball carrier never had a chance. Sullivan on the option. <laughs> bring him down at the 16. That was an outstanding tackle. That is staying with the play. Staying with the quarterback long enough to make sure he doesn't cut inside. And then once he throws it off. Going to get in that halfback. From their own 16-yard line, it's third down. Defense. Defense. Yeah! Drops to throw. <laughs> they couldn't pick up the first down. Good so job, defense. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass. If you took out that one drive where they scored, I bet they would have negative yards if you excluded that drive. No! Somebody held! There's a flag on the field. I think I have a good feeling of what this might be. Probably Captain Football. On the receiver's team. Yup, Captain hugs a lot. Holding Did they not hug you enough when you were a baby? But sometimes if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. That's to go. Has had enough of that bullshit. <laughs> First and ten. There's no need to hug there. We're doing well. If you want to hug after the game, go for it. They go with the run. Ooh, they go in to go Wolfie. Great job He's breaking that tackle. To the 10. He scores. What a play. He's got two touchdowns on the ground today. This Man, Indigo Wolfie having a huge day. <laughs> He's just like, see you, suckers. And it's good. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Man, I'm going to miss Muhammad. Muhammad has been like a below average kicker, but compared to Adams last year, that's been outstanding. But Muhammad's a senior, so we got to try a whole new kicker next year. Ah, oh, sucks. So I think we injured another dude. For something better on this drive. I don't know what these guys have to do to get back on track, but they need to try something. That's horrible advice from the announcer. I don't know what you need to do, but try something. That doesn't give them a way to win. Good option play. The fullback got about six yards there. 
That was a smart play. If we're going to keep showing three men front, you might as well run. Sullivan drops to throw. Ooh, good pressure. Good job by the defense there. Somebody better go get the trainer. I'll tell you what, that tailback is lucky to still have his helmet on after that shot. It's third down, three to go. I think they get their starting quarterback next quarter too, don't they? They know we injured him early. That might make a difference for him. You're not going anywhere. Just sit down. They'll be short of the first down after that unsuccessful running play. Nice job here by the defense of holding firm and forcing a fourth down. Didn't get all of that one. Ooh. Well, at least there is no hold there. And he didn't get anything on that return. Well, the coverage team did an outstanding job at containing here. You always see this with this team. They're very disciplined on special teams. Play action under pressure. Oh, Boy, a that didn't exactly work the way it was supposed to. <laughs> I know, surprise, surprise. You didn't drop that play where he runs there and nobody can get it? Well, you know. Nice seven-yard run by Wolfie. So far. The coaches have really got to be thrilled with how well he's been running so far. He's Actually, I am. We've got over 100 yards already in but also only one half. Not even a half yet. That's another first. I would like to get the ball to Tenlo Soul, considering it's his last on. regular season game, but they keep doing a good job covering him. Drops back to pass, catches it, and he's looking for more. Oh, -hoo! good spin by Butler. The Butler did do it there. He diagnosed the blitz immediately and had time to improvise for the big play. That's the kind of quick thinking you need to succeed Woo! as a quarterback. They're at the seven. First down. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one will result in another touchdown. Oh, it's pretty cool. Yeah, there we go. That's his third trip to the end zone. Man, if you had a fantasy team with Wolfie on it, you'd be kicking ass. Can't shrug the rushing attack soon. And this game is going to get up. All right, let's kick that extra point. Anchors away again, my friends. And he tacks on the extra point. Let's take a glance at the drive summary. I'm going to go out there and be like, put down the N. Put out a G and a R. I want my gravy flakes out. Mm. I want another Thanksgiving dinner. Forty-one. That was like your mom getting nailed. <laughs> like, coach, you're rude. The offense will take over at the sixteen. Go, 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 go! <laughs> so you're going nowhere, quarterback. You're the sack back today. Look at that. Six hurries, three knockdowns, and what was that? Four sacks. If you, if, if you go up to him and you're like, you want to play hacky sack, he'll probably freak out. Don't say that word again. Too many sacks. There must be times if you're a quarterback where you have nightmares about that. Army desperately wanting to get to the half. You can see because they're not running a play. They'll probably just run it here. Take it into the half. Because they're sick of getting their butts kicked. Oh, maybe not. That was odd. I don't know any idea why they would do that. You, you waste all that time, you might as well just run it. Go into the half and try and regroup. Or cry, whichever you like better. 
defensive end came through to put him away. Nice job. Hey, that was a good first half. Get in there and then make a sure tackle. There's no way they're going to punt this. <laughs> Why are you punting it, you idiots? He makes it out to maybe the 36 yard line. And that's it for the first half, man. This game. Maybe that's the key. We had a pass defense there. Maybe we should call pass defenses more on punt returns. Yeah, we have a slight lead, ever so slight. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the depth chart. I don't know where the depth chart is. Strategy. Depth chart. And we're gonna put in some backups. We put Mr. America in for Thomas. And then we're going to put Skinner in for Wolfie. They can come back in if they need to, Wolfie or whoever. Man, why is Roberts not starting? Oh, because he's a junior and Wolfie's a freshman. I think Wolfie's really good at carrying two or something. So the kicker lines up to the idea is we don't want to get any key people injured if we can avoid it. Now, obviously, we can't sit the whole team. He'll return this one from the seven. Oh, shit. If I had to bump that guy, Club Panic might have been gone. Field again. Now's the offense. And I got to tell you, these guys have just been a defensive nightmare on the past few drives. Number 17 comes in at quarterback. Navy up by a bunch. Who get those blocks. Nice. He makes his way to about the 42. About eight yards there. This is hopefully a impose our will drive. I don't know if we even need one when we're up by so much, but second and two. We gotta show them that Navy's the best branch. Oh, that's the first. Nice gain as he works the right side. Nice run there by the tailback, and it's good for the first. Solid five. Those are some cool moves. <laughs> Because it's snowing. I want to get the ball to Tenlo so We got to help him break his record in this game if we can. Come on, get free. Oh. Whoever he's got covering him is pretty solid. He's not getting much separation. He's got to relax and just make a good throw. Straight run, nothing going on there. The running back gets two on the carry. Yeah, trying to get some third and manageables. Third and lunchables, delicious. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 43. Navy. Oh man, that looks so nice, right up in the middle. If those blow oh, you shit lords! You didn't block. Was well defended by this defense. The offensive line is so concerned with their penetrating abilities that these linebackers are able to roam free and make plays like that. Alexander awaits the snap. Plenty of hang time on this one. Calls for the fair catch. Not once again. Nah, that should have been hit a little harder. Oh. Well. Jenkins is in at quarterback. Oh, yep, they got their quarterback in. You can see it's number two. The backup was number one. And it's still the same result on those option plays. We got a three-man front where we've got speed on the field. Everybody spread wide. Why would you run option there? Just run it right up at the three-man front. Ooh, someone pick it up. I meant on our side. He is close to becoming the most prolific sack artist in team history. They'll be sure to bring him up in the conversation about the most dominant defenders in school history. He's earned his spot here. I like the term sack artist. So uh, he's got to have like a little beret. No, I'm a sack artist. Jenkins, back to throw. Uh-oh. Oh, please be on them. Was he in the end zone when it happened? The perfect timing to jar the ball loose. I mean, I was tempted to say yes and accept it. <laughs> he is not happy. Has to go. Go sucker punch him in the back of the head. 
When he's not looking. That's one ripped donkey. Yeah, I thought about getting greedy, getting greedy, and accepting the penalty, driving them back, and making them do it again. But that would have been stupid. Don't give him another chance. Yeah, good return by Club Panic. We'll see if they can capitalize on the good field position. Takes a snap and he oh, shit! Oh, that was way overthrown. That was a horrible throw by Mr. America on the run. Yeah, that was just not nice. See, I should have accepted the penalty and been rude. Oh, we injured another of those guys. I'm sorry, Army. We're just powerful, and you're weak like babies. Do you need the titty milk? Straight in the middle, and he meets the defense. I don't know if I've ever said that before in one of these LPs. At least not for this series, but who knows. Now, look at that. Death, t Death Haven has had 50 tackles this season. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. That's what they should have been doing more earlier. I'm not saying getting one yard gains. Obviously, a one yard gain is not usually the ticket to success unless you're fourth and one. But taking advantage of a three man front and running right at it. They want all these east west yards. See? They're trying to do an option, but they couldn't even get anywhere. He got bumped up because we were shoving their guys backwards. Just anything to counter the aggressive blitzes from this. Their coach is like, I know the option will work eventually. If I run it like 40 times, it works once, it'll work again. And down he goes. Captain Football, that was useless. You just stood there. They'll set up shot at the 42 yard line. Skinner! Skinner takes it up the middle. Yeah, he doesn't have... I think the other stat, part of the reason Laura's character is decent, is I think she has more power for trucking through people. Skinner does not seem to have that. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 44-yard line. Navy in control. Speaking of which, if you've not had a character and you want a character for next season... Let me know on this video or the next one, and I'll uh, write it down for next year. No, 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 you turds! Straight run, and he's brought down in the backfield. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking schemes. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. They're calling an audible. Back to pass. Oh, damn it. That was overthrown. Tenless all got open. But Mr. Merrick overthrew it. That sucks. Because he was wide open there. He just overthrew it. Hunter, the return man. He hits a low one there. That was a great kick. The defense really shut these guys down uh, last time they had the ball. They'll start this drive at the 34. First and 10. I think, too, right now with the way the offense is playing, just shows how big Wolfie and Thomas have been this year for helping us win. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. Williams gets the option and takes it forward for about a three-yard gain. Is their playbook nothing but option plays? There you go. No! Oh, we should have had him. That is embarrassing. That's four yards on the Did he board. find a playbook from like 1908? It's good enough. No reason to change anything. They'll run the option. And they got him for a loss. Maybe that's why they run so many options. Maybe against other teams, maybe he's broken more tackles. I doubt it though, because they're only like four and seven. Yeah, nice block. 
they push him out at the 37. The last time this offense had the ball, it was three and out. They'll go to work at the 37-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Navy with a big advantage. Rolling out to the right side. There we go. Finally hit Tendall so. That gives him the team's all-time mark for receiving yards. Good for him. He's always been a fierce competitor and a great talent. Yeah, all-time career. I've said it a million times a season. You all know it. Career receiving yards and I believe career receiving touchdowns. From the 40-yard line. First down. Yeah, let's try an option. They're all about the option all the time. We could do it too. Here's the option left. Aha, it worked, you turns. It actually worked really well. Go Skinner. That is, I think, the best option play we've ran in all the seasons I've coached here at Navy. We reach the end of three, and this game is all but decided. The score here in Denver is Navy 35, Army 3. I wish they had a ticker at the bottom about the other games. We need Ohio State to lose to Michigan. All right, Mr. Rogers, let's give you the ball so we can punch this thing in. Run here as it's first and goal. Another trip to the red zone. Last time, it resulted in a touchdown. And it does again! Where you at, Ass and Goat? Time to celebrate. Ass and Goat. Don't go to the tunnels, Mr. Rogers. We've got more game to play. There he is. That is a good drive. We're only seven minutes away from ending the season. This has been such a fun season, too. The Zambles! Give me that ball. Jenkins. Give me that ball. So it's second and ten. That makes it second and ten. Whoever we play after this will probably be a lot tougher. I guess that goes without saying, but I said it anyway. Oh, this should have done another option play. Oops, somebody punch him. No! Oh! I guess that's what they've been trying to do with option plays. Get that guy going. He's got some speed. God damn it. Somebody did not get back in time. If you're going to be that late, you might as well just land on the quarterback. And he helped the offense with that penalty. And you have to be careful here because the offense will get a free play, which could become even more costly than the five-yard penalty. Jenkins, back to throw. Rose, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a quarterback. You've got to have an ability to lay the ball right into your guys' hands. Uh, luckily for us, they have not passed very well for most of the game. Like an option here. Oh man, they just wiped out one of our dudes. An option? Whoa, what a surprise! Oh, he slipped on the snow. The sucks our guy didn't catch it right there. He had a hand on it. I mean, we're running the most vanilla defense right now, too. Gets out to about the 42. Problem is, Jenkins only gets about a yard there on the option keeper. 
Would we'll our nickel 335. We have enough fast guys on here that we can usually run the quarterback down. But man, they are in love with that option play. He's looking to pass. Throw in deep down the left side. Get up there, catch it. Yeah, Quentin Daniels. That is exactly the kind of play you want to see from a safety. He needs to be able to read the play and then make the interception. Yeah, nice job scooping that thing up. First down, Make some snow angels ass to go. Maybe it'll look like snow demons because he's got horns though. I don't know. Hands it off. Ooh, Skinner busts through! Holy shit! At the 40, across Nobody's gonna catch him. To the 20, to the 10. I think he's trying to tie and Indigo Wolfie's for yards for this game. Well, this that was huge. Didn't need it, but it was awesome. Sometimes you play in a game and you can't do anything wrong. You find yourself in a rhythm or a zone. This whole team seems like they've been in a rhythm since we kicked this game off. Was the announcer saying something about padding stats? Because we weren't trying to pad stats there. We were running the ball. I mean, I guess I don't have a problem with padding stats, but he just busted through everybody. What's he going to do? Just sit down? And it's good. Converts the extra point. Five minutes remaining in the fourth quarter, and the score is Navy 49, Army 3. Navy, to kick this one off. We've got a chance if we keep this up, and we don't have to do a lot more. That we might have 200, two 100 yard rushers in this game. Navy, the 16 yard line. You know the offense will be looking to do better this time out. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. Sherman? Interesting. Very army name. Back to Somebody back. get him. Yeah. And they will keep the drive alive by recovering their own fumble. They just lost nine yards on that. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and Our long. team takes it very literal when they say push him back, push him back, push him way back. Jenkins options out, and down he goes. An option play. I don't remember in previous years playing them that they ran this many options. And we've played them every year. They're always the last game of the regular season. That's tradition in uh, college football. Oh! Oh, man. We almost had a major sack right there. Lamb to punt. It's away. Short punt. Get that block. That is not getting the block. The 39 yard line. You wonder what kind of impact the special teams play will have on the series that comes after a play like that. This could be big for the defense. A long field didn't bother them the last time out, and that's how they'll set up for this drive. Now at this point, we're do. just going to try and keep that clock going. Heading for the corner. Has some daylight. Oh, I didn't mean to get out of bounds. Man, look at that. 167 yards rushing already. Their last red zone trip resulted in a touchdown. I don't expect this one to be any different. Honestly, we're not going for a touchdown. We will probably get one if we continue succeeding like this. I forgot, if I move the controller around, it does the fake cut. But, but, big butt. Six yards on the play. That'll make it second and four. Skinner, we're gonna just keep running you ragged. Because I don't want to injure any of our other dudes. Navy with a commanding lead. Not only commanding, but we'll get the commander in chief trophy for winning this game. Even though you've already seen it earlier in the year. Keep going, Skinner. Yeah, we're definitely not doing a QB sneak. I don't want to risk injuring Mr. America. I know he's our backup, but if something happens in the bowl game, we're going to need him to be healthy. Now you can see a lot of people already left. They must think we might win. Oh, Wolfie! 
They had Wolfie coming off the bench. I wasn't paying attention to what number it was. No, 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 no. First and goal from the four. They're knocking on the door. Navy up big. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Play fake. God damn it, nobody's open! Good job of Mr. America running into himself. If you saw, I was looking for Tenlo Soul. They had a lot of guys back there, no reason to force it. takes things into his own hands, especially down inside the ten. Yeah, the window was kind of small right there. I didn't want to risk that. Works out. Come on, this has got to com convince the coaches, right? I probably won't look at that in this video. I think next video will be the one where we have the reveal. I'm sorry to wait till next one of where we are in the standings. Who we're going to play. Part of it is I'm having fun. We're on a good groove. Like, I want to keep our dreams alive. Gets to about the 17 yard line. You know, they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Uh, they ought to just run the ball at this point with another option. He looks to throw on first down. Yeah. This one will fall incomplete. The defense really missed a golden opportunity there. That's what separates a good player from a great player. When you have a that is the only weakness of our defense, is they're not great at getting turnovers. But all in all, they're probably the best defense we've ever had. Gets it out to his receiver and he can't hang on. Because they're more consistent about stopping the run, knocking passes down. Third and ten. Where was this pass-happy offense earlier? Oh, well, that's actually a good pass. If they had done this earlier, they might have competed more. That announcer is crap on crack. Saying he took apart every secondary he's faced? They're not taking apart our team. We're up 56-3. to I don't think he knows what it means to take apart every team <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. 3,000 yards is still pretty impressive in a season. But they've not all been against us. Come on, Brick. Get on through. You stop that. Nice catch. First down. He's knocked out. I like how the offense is using the pass to get him involved. He's explosive. And you just want to get the ball in his hands. I'm thinking you're throwing it over here by Sherman. Jenkins drops back on first down. No! Oh! Oh, our dude's tipped it up and he got it. Well, that was just a well-executed play. They picked the perfect time to stretch the defense. Cobain got a hand on it and he slaps it up and it bounces off of somebody's shoulder and then he catches it. That is just bad luck. It's first and ten. Ball on the twenty. They're in the red zone again, but this time they should be thinking touchdown. They go with the option. He's tackled at the twenty. I am. Um, I don't. <laughs> there's a reason I don't use the camera in these videos because I want the focus to be the game. But at that one, I was just shaking my head. What the hell were they thinking there? That was a whole lot of stupid. Oh, somebody tackle him! Ah! I'm surprised their band had it fallen asleep. That was a good drive. They're obviously going to try and onside it. Even if they got it, there's no way they're coming back. Sheepies! Oh, he got tattooed on that one. A lot of dreams they had of a comeback just ended right there. Yeah, Brad, even if they were able to recover that onside kick, they still probably would not have had enough time. They 
takes a snap and he's in go, front. Mr. America, go. He has <laughs> Don't get touched. It's not line. worth it. That scramble gets them seven yards. From the 31 yard line, it's second down. They're changing the play. Fakes to the back. Come on, Tenlo, so get up. Oh. Right, we're just going to run it and end it. I was being a little rude there. I want to see if we can get Tenlo, so one last catch in the regular season. Oh, man, Butler's open. We're just going to run it. Holy shit. Guess it don't matter. Skinner wanted another touchdown. For Skinner. Holy shit, we got 300 yards on the ground then between two halfbacks. Even Acid Goat, does he deserve credit? So I'll give him some. I'm going to give him the game ball. He's my player of the game. That was close. Oh, man, if they would have lost it, that would have been adding insult to injury for a tough game that they had. Oh, I hope we didn't hurt him, too. This is going to be the end of their season. With the record they have, I know almost everybody gets a bowl game now, but them going like 4-8, and eight, I doubt they're getting a bowl game. That would figure that would be their last play. The play they died with. The option. We win big 63 to 10. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, Navy 63, Army 10. We are undefeated for the season. I think we were undefeated last year too. Two undefeated seasons in a row. Well, if you don't count bowl games because we didn't lose the Rose Bowl last year. Now it's time to present the Reese's Perfect Play of the Game, which is brought to you by Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. The Who would have thought Skinner would be play? Oh, he'd be the play of the game. He might be player of the game too because he put up a lot of yards there. They wanted to win this game, and they came out and just dominated. You can see how satisfied they are, not just with the win, but winning big against their big rival. You hear that team? You satisfied all the people in the stands. Nasty. For Skinner, his efforts today have earned him player of the game. Skinner, this is probably the only time Skinner will ever be player of the game. And I think he only played about a half. Yeah, give us that Commander in Chief trophy. Technically, I think we've seen that twice now. I believe he only Navy actually went it once in a year. What they say? It's like a round robin Army, between Army, Air Force, and Navy. Disappointing four and eight record. Thank that does it for this edition of NCAA Football 11. I'm Brad Nessler saying so long for Kirk Herbstreit and Aaron Andrews. Both Wolfie and Skinner had one of those huge breakout runs. Yeah, Club Panic, too, early on had that big catch. Just pulled them into the end zone. Their, their team did not do well. Obviously, they ran way too many option plays. But the few times their quarterback got in a ro roll, you know, he got some tempo, he actually did pretty good. It's like, oh, don't grab my booty. All right, let's look at the game stats before I head out. I mostly want to see the halfback ones. Mr. America only had one completion for five attempts. Thomas only had four completions for six attempts. It must have been big, though. Um, and then rushing, that's where it was at. Look at that. Wolfie, 9.5 average per run. Skinner, 18.8. .8. Both of them with over 100 yards. Both of them with more than two touchdowns. Three for Wolfie, two for Skinner. Man, just an outstanding game. Well, that's the last regular season game. Next time I see you... We got the holding stat. Man, Kevin Football loves to do that. Next time I see y'all, we'll hopefully be the bowl game. Oh, I hope, I hope, I hope. And we'll find out next time.
Sorry for the cliffhanger again. I hope Ohio State lost. I'll see y'all next time when we find out.